Frankie was the best selection that the uh, governor made. I really can't tell you uh, just how much of a shock it was when, when he was murdered. Am I speaking with Kevin Frankie? Yes. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your brother Mike has been murdered. The way we see it, he was stabbed at the car and then staggered over to the north portico before he died. I believe you, we will do everything within our powers to find the perpetrator of this crime. It's very important in a case like this not to let the public know everything. In other words, no talking to the press. My brother had told me that he had found something in the corrections department and that he was going to have to clean house. Now, I think that has something to do with his murder. Don't get involved with these people, Kevin. They're dangerous. What people? I think you're being followed. What do you mean? The yellow cab. The cops running. Get your hands in the cop! got something to do with drugs going into prison. I think your brother knew about it. No, no, this is not off the record. I want to talk to somebody about what's going on. You know who killed my brother? He was a state official here before. Somebody's gonna get you. It'll always be her word against the police. Why don't you listen to the citizens of this state? One of those guys is gonna get you. Whose payroll are you on? So One of those... I find that an offensive gesture. I think we can now later rest all the speculation and media stories about conspiracies. The autopsy report, they only said half of it. And what they did send, they blacked out most of it. When they go down, you're going down with them. Wait, are you threatening me? I don't need to threaten you. You're a dead man. So what'd you learn from Jody? That I'm not done here. You know who killed my brother? <laughs>